In this video, I show how to do the electrical planning using the software. You can do the electrical planning with two-dimensional symbols in two-dimensional mode, and you can also plan three-dimensional objects. I have opened the symbol catalog here. When you open it, you'll find the electrical symbols here. And before I draw them, I measure a specific distance with guidelines. I click on Guideline, click on Parallel, and measure from this wall a parallel guideline that should have a distance of 50 centimeters. And another one with 250 centimeters distance. And now I have marked my distance and can place the electrical symbols. One must know that unfortunately, the electrical symbols are stored very small in the software. That's why you have to click on Show Input Options before drawing them and enter a minimum size. I'll leave it at 5 centimeters now. Then I select a symbol and place it at the desired spot that I measured beforehand. I can also create an extra layer for these electrical symbols that I can name. And I uh, measure once more the um, electrical symbols. And I also apply this dimensioning, um, assign it to my new layer. And so, for example, I can select that I can show, hide, and reveal the electrical symbols at any time in the floor plan. By the way, I should turn off my floor plan from map to div view, um, then I can see my symbols better. And as I said, I can show and hide the layer with the electrical symbols and the spacing here. And next, I will show how to, um, import your own electrical symbols. For that, you click here on File, then on Import, Import Image, and I have already taken two screenshots of uh, electrical symbols from the internet. I select one, and it is now imported here. I can make it smaller once. And I can, um, place this symbol in my floor plan at any location. And I can also add this image to my symbol catalog. I select it, drag it in, and just need to name it. And it is already saved. Here is this symbol um, in my electrical symbol catalog. And next, I would like to show that we also have three-dimensional symbols and three-dimensional objects for electrical planning. It's a bit misleading. Um, in the folder Plants, which unfortunately is misnamed, you have to click in, and there are electrical 3D symbols. There are only a few there, but you can also import 3D objects from the warehouse by Google SketchUp. We have another video for that, and you can import as many sockets and switches and such as you like. I am now placing a switch here on my wall. And in 3D mode, I see this switch here, and I click on size and lift it at 90 centimeters. And have such a wall socket planned on my wall. And that is how you conduct electrical planning in our software. 